when I uh, when I first started building this engine, um, it started off just as a bit of fun. But the further I got in building it, the more seriously I took it. And um, I eventually call it the SP3A. Now, to understand a bit about the uh, reasoning behind that, first of all we need a bit of a history lesson. Um, in the beginning, God created Meccano. That's not what the Bible tells you, but uh, whoever whoever wrote Genesis got it all wrong. Uh, God created Meccano. In fact, uh, rumor has it that God and Frank Hornby are one and the same, but I'm not so sure about that. Anyway, if you don't know anything about Meccano, if you've never heard of it, where have you been living all this time? Um, but if you don't know anything about Meccano, just go into Wikipedia. That will tell you all about it. Um, in the early days of Meccano, they obviously decided that they wanted an engine to drive Meccano models. And in those days, the obvious answer was a steam engine. So they introduced the, the Meccano steam engine. Um, now the first one was just a very ordinary, very typical toy steam engine. The, um, a vertical boiler, vertical cylinder. I don't know who made it, but it was sort of a typical of a Nuremberg German design. Nothing really special about it at all. Now, very soon, Meccano decided they wanted something which is a bit more designed for Meccano. So they introduced this one. Now, this one was also called the Meccano engine, the Meccano steam engine. But it was designed with a, a special base um, with Meccano spaced holes. Uh, it was designed to be built into Meccano models instead of just being attached to it for our, uh, uh, a belt. Now, again, I don't know who made these. It may well have been Meccano themselves. But whoever it was, um, it was at some point decided that they couldn't or didn't want to continue making them. So Meccano got in touch with Mamad, who were the uh, perhaps the ultimate in uh, steam toys in those days, certainly in Britain. And Mamad came up with this, um, which is similar, sort of an, uh, an advancement on the original Meccano one. Main difference is that the, it has a, a horizontal boiler instead of a vertical one. It's a typical uh, boiler of Mamad boiler in those days. Um, and Mamad designed a cylinder unit to, uh, to go with it. Now that was a, an extremely popular engine. Um, it's commonly known as the Mech 1 but um, it was just called, officially it was just the Meccano steam engine. Now uh, um, eventually Meccano stopped uh, selling the, that engine under their own name and so the Mech 1 was discontinued. 
the car now went on to electric motors basically. But when Mamad updated their whole range and introduced the SP range, they modified the MEC one slightly and called it the SP3. Uh, um, they're basically the same as the Mech 1. Um, silver base instead of yellow. Uh, got a whistle on it. Um, and it used uh, solid fuel tablets instead of meths. But uh, basically a very similar engine to the to Mech 1. Now this was a bit strange because the, the rest of the SP range of engines um, which uh, replaced the SE range of Mamad engines most of them had a lot, a lot in common with each other. Uh, this is a typical one, this is the SP2 uh, this replaced the Mamad Minor 2 and uh, it has lots of features in common with the whole of the SP range. Um, it had this cast chimney here, which was the same on all of the SP range, except for the SP3. And also this uh, style of uh, firebox um, was similar on all of the SP range. But, as you can see, the SP3 didn't comply with that sort of generalised uh, that theme of the SP range. It didn't have the chimney and it didn't have the, um, the chrome firebox. So this is where my SP3A came in. I took the SP3 as uh, Mamad introduced it and turned it into what the what it should have been with the cast chimney and the uh, and the chrome firebox is actually built from uh, bits and pieces from a an SP4 bit, bits of an SP4 which is where the the boiler and firebox came from um, and also the chimney base the chimney was missing so I had to replace that. Um, the, uh, the Meccano style base um, was actually came from a, a Mech one, it was an old uh, yellow one, because that's what I happened to have handy. Uh, I, I repainted it silver. So that's uh, where this, all, this originated. It's what the Mamad SP3 should have been. So let's give it a try. Let's uh, give it a run.
very impressive uh, steam plume there. 